deflection went for the tallest guy on the floor. Thompson, three-pointer. Got it! Clay Thompson from downtown. One-point game, under two to play in the second overtime. D'Angelo Russell's got to make good decisions here. He dodged a bullet that last possession, and he makes another mistake. Wiggins with the deflection. Kaminga holding it, wait for Draymond Green. Reeves right up into Curry. Now Davis. Five to shoot. Curry. Three putters up. Down! Steph Curry does it again. Warriors by two. Reeves on the drive. Davis jump shot. Nope. A foul before the shot. First team foul. First in the last two minutes, but... I believe Clay Thompson's going to foul out. Mike, they keep getting Steph with Anthony Davis, and they're letting him work in space. Remember the last time he went to the layup. Now he steps back and gets separation on the three. So Clay Thompson is fouled out. Pajemski comes in. First time Thompson's fouled out this season. Russell guarded by Kaminga. Two key deflections from Golden State here. Russell gets passed. Stolen by Green. Here comes Green. Back out Pajemski. Three-pointer. Rebound Vanderbilt. Under a minute remaining. And Russell in the front court. No hesitation. It's good. D'Angelo Russell once again. And the Lakers go up by one. Mike, he had three possessions where he made big-time mistakes. The gut to do that. Curry pulls up, jump shot. Off the side, and James the rebound with 36 seconds remaining. Both teams still with timeouts left. Lakers have two. Reeves looking. Russell wants the ball. Russell the drive, pull up, jump shot. Won't go, gets his own rebound. Back out to James. There's a five-second difference shot clock and game clock. Free throws here from Austin Reeves. Lakers from the free throw line, just superb. 36 of 40, 90 percent. Misses the second. Rebound, Draymond Green, and the Warriors will call timeout. Their final timeout with 12.2, and again, critical that miss because now they don't have to go for a three. Davis plays the inbound. Curry gets free with Vanderbilt on him. Reeves picks him up, and there's the foul to give, so with 7.3 remaining, that's a good use. Knocked off about four seconds. Now the Warriors have to do it again. Remember, Warriors out of timeouts. We anticipate them doing the same thing, Mike. Small to small screen. See if you can't get Reeves switched on to Steph. Curry comes free. Curry, wide open three. Contact, but not not enough for a whistle. Vanderbilt sitting there looking for a, a foul call. The greatest three-point shooter in NBA history had all that room. That's in, that's incredible. He's got ten points here in the second overtime. This is his ninth three-pointer of the night, and it gives the Warriors the lead with 4.7 remaining. Now both teams out of timeouts. No fouls to give, 4.7 remaining. Plenty of time to get off a quality shot. Reeves to James. 
James puts it on the floor, drives inside, layup is up. Foul! James will go to the line with 1.2 remaining. He was frustrated that he didn't get the last pass. He felt like there was an opportunity to get him. This time, they free their teammate with a good screen by D'Angelo. He's one-on-one. -on -one. Jonathan Kaminga, that's not good enough. Draymond's that last line of defense. But Pajimski closes top side. That's a reach and slap. Kaminga, that's simply not good enough, Mike. Just a smart play from James to take it to the basket, not settle for a jumper. Hits the first to tie the game. There's still 1.2 remaining, even if he hits this one. But Golden State out of timeouts. James perfect from the line, 5 for 5. A 35-point, 20 rebound, 12 assist, triple-double. Lakers lead. Warriors have to throw it down the length. Hope for a miracle. Curry launches at the buzzer. Won't go, and the Lakers hold on and win in double overtime. What a performance from LeBron James and the Lakers to get the road win. And what an excruciating loss once again for the Golden State Warriors. Back-to-back -back games, Mike, with an opportunity to win and come up a play short again. 32 clutch games, 15 and 17 in those. Despite 46. The respect factor there, off the charts. Two friends, two legends, two champions. And boy, do they battle here tonight. Just extraordinary competitors doing incredible things almost every trip up the floor. Let's go to Lisa. Are you tired? Um, no. No, not really. Uh, my body's a little run down. All right, ready? Give it what you got. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Are you sure you're the oldest player in the league? No, nah, I, don't, I don't think so. I, I don't feel like it. I go out there and try to compete and be young. A lot of the young guys on our team keep me young. Competing with guys like Kaminga, that keeps me young. Steph keeps me young, too. And, you know, we two are the older guys in the league, but it was fun today. I saw the love that you guys just gave each other. This is the first time in the regular season of all the times you've gone up against each other, first time it's ever gone to overtime right. and a double overtime. Right. Just how does matching up against another great like that, what kind of motivation does that add? Uh, it's something that you will um, truly take all in when you're done playing and be able to watch with your grandkids, you know, and say that I played against one of the best players that ever played this game. Um, you know, and Steph, after the game, came to me and said, how does it keep getting better? You know, how do we keep getting better? And, you know, I think it's just a true testament to us uh, putting the work in in the game, being true to the game, and the game just continue to get back to us. How do you keep, how do you keep getting better? This sustained excellence. It's crazy. Um, I think um, appreciating and understanding the ones that came before us, um, you know, and then never taking the game for granted, knowing that at any moment it can't be taken away from you. So, you know, every time we step on the floor, every time we have film sessions, every time, we, you know, we're around our teammates, we try to pour energy into them. And the game allows, to, gives us back on, um, on the home, on the game court when we get on the floor. So, myself and Steph, I don't want to talk for him or speak for him, but I think, think we're just true to the game. Thank you for everything. Uh, appreciate it. Congrats on the win. Appreciate All right, Lisa, we said it earlier tonight. We don't know how much longer we'll have the, the privilege of watching the LeBron James and Steph Curry go out of two great champions, two of the greatest to ever play this game. And they put on a show for the fans, certainly the Laker fans jubilant, the Warrior fans heartbroken, and the NBA fans feeling fortunate to be able to watch it.